Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here, and welcome to another video. Ladies and gentlemen, we have uh, four different Team of the Seasons to review for this team. Always nice when the players are at a, a very like affordable area, because I bought these cards at a very good time, because they're going up in price, so hopefully when I sell them, I'm like breaking even at least. Uh, but yeah, we have the new Team of the Season Zaha card to review today, guys. They did a really good job with this card, to be honest with you. Uh, 511 high medium work rates, right footed. Uh, five star skill moves with a four star weak foot. In game player traits, he has the flare trait, technical dribbler traits, in game attributes. Take a look at how this card's formatted, right? So he has 87 stamina, which, as you guys know, I always tell you is a pretty decent cutoff when it comes to the stamina in this game. So if you actually want to use them in the side areas, it's not necessarily like a big problem uh, to have it at an 87. It's usually like the good cutoff area. Uh, but obviously, we use them through the middle for the most part to test out attacking AI and all that kind of stuff, trying out some shot angles and whatnot. Uh, but yeah, base card stats for pace on Zaha set up really nicely already at a 97, 98. Uh, shooting for the card is going to be essentially perfect uh, because we're going to be giving him the marksman chemistry style. A lot of people are giving him the dead eye. Uh, but you guys know me, I got to improve the dribbling part of the card as much as possible. Even if it's threes and fours and fives, I got to do it. I understand why they do this, though, because of the attacking positioning boost while also boosting his passing by quite a bit. But like I said, I'm probably still going to give him a marksman anyways, because the passing is in a pretty decent area, in my opinion. But yeah, shooting's going to be in a good area with a high medium work rate. So very curious to see um, how he plays with that. For passing for base card stats, like I said, it is in a pretty solid area as well. I could see why people give the improvement, though, just in general, because if you give them the Deadeye chemistry style, the vision, the shore passing, it's nice. I'm not going to say that it isn't, right? But um, I just want to see what he's like on this first, right? Uh, so dribbling we'll be experimenting with, because with Zaha, guys, he has a unique body type. So with a unique body type, we need to see what his dribbling stats is going to be like with that body type, right? Uh, I like that agility and balance is in a pretty decent area, considering the fact that he's 5'11". So... Uh, very curious to see what that's going to be like. He's got 90 for strength, 80 for aggression. And then with the Marksman Chemistry style, we will be boosting the strength and the jumping part of the card. Uh, so with Zaha, guys, we are going to be using him uh, in the tactics as we normally do. I need to add the 3-5-2 tactic because that tactic is really good for uh, player reviews. But for now, we'll use the 3-4-1-2. Draxler here, Tim Cahill here. Switch that with this guy. And Ganga with Klaus, and then we could do this over here. Perfect. We could do this. I need to see if they change the weak foot for Kakarot, because uh, we're going to review him too. Yeah, this is actually set up very nicely. I like this a lot. Very, very cool. For the review, we have to put him on the left side, though. Yeah. Instructions getting behind, stay forward. Yeah. Okay, cool. Let's try him out. Oh, that was a crazy dip. Oh, that was a crazy dip. If I greened it, that would have been... I think that's a goal. Beautiful, Zaha. I like it. Touch it. Oh. Yo, he has... I'm telling you guys, like, he has some really crazy finesse shot animations. I gotta green these, bro. Ah, oh, I put too much power. I have to do a ball roll strike to the near post there with him. In that area, definitely. Oh yeah, I'm gonna get all muscled there. For sure. Oh, that was hugely emphasized. That was crazy. Oh, oh, he messed that up. No green, though. Low percentage strike, you know? You know the vibes, you know the vibes. First time. Good finish. Let's go, Zaha. Oh, Veron, I hate you.
Well done, Zaha. Well positioned. Good finish. Beautiful build up play, too. Bro, L1 Elastico is just nuts, man. It, it, the animation against the, the defenders is just weird. Ooh, nice try, Zaha. Better with the small little dribbles. It was fantastic. Well done. There we go, boys. There we go. We're moving. We're moving. Ooh, decent finesse shots. Decent finesse shot. Inside the 18, too. Oh, that's... uh. That's FIFA meta right there, right, guys? Nice little L1 Elastico. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, come on, dude. Come on. Yeah, his finesse shots are actually kind of nice. If you green them, like, that's a, that's a low percentage strike because the... Uh, Dribble he's coming off of. Oh, I wish. You can't do that against the goalie. They're going to catch it every single time. Oh, I caught him on that dribble right there. Is that a penalty? Yes, sir. Hey, let me switch them, bro. Let me switch them. Wilfred Zaha. Do you think he's going to... Down the middle? Ah, he knew. He knew he was going to do it. It's, I'm telling you guys, every time I do a penalty and I switch the player, they always go down the middle. Wow, good chip shot. Let's go, Zaha. Oh, it was a good volley, too. Unlucky. Ah, yeah, bro, the five-star skills, it's always fun to score those goals, man. Come on, you know, you know, chat, you know. Oh, if I megged you there. Oh, really? I have to shoot that across there? No way. I'm telling you, bro, those finesse shots, when you hit those greens, he... Oh, no, he hits it nice. Yes, aha, uh -huh, with a weak foot. I like it. I like it. Great finish. So what I will say about the Zaha card, guys, is that this is probably the first year that I like him more than any other year, to be honest with you. But it's funny, man, because they do something to his body type where he still has that feeling of restriction sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Like, he, he does emphasis touches in weird spots uh, in certain cases. Like, you definitely could see it for sure. You see that shot cancel right there? How he kind of does that thing to it. Oh my goodness. He tackled me and I didn't get a pen there. What? First time. Oh, not great. Get back to it. Oh. Oh, I try to get him on the ball roll scoop. Oh, man. Couldn't get the shot off there at Draxler, but it was a good pass, though. Really well weighted. Should be good. There we go. Let's go, Zaha. Regular shot. Great finish. Let's go. Yeah, I just wanted to try a strike with a weak foot to see how it would kind of come off. Dude, L1 at last call is just insane, man. Oh my goodness. Aw. Uh, oh. No, dude. Hit 
His volleys are super clean, man. Oh my goodness, could you... <laughs> could you imagine I scored that? Oh, I was trying to get like a left stick to act it against the goalkeeper, you know, but I didn't find the angle there. Right through the legs. Oh. Oi. <laughs> oh, my goodness. No, I wish I wish his left stick was more responsive. I was trying to do like quick like left sticks to go back up and stuff. I just couldn't do it quick enough. Red was uh, really good there though. Oh, I got it! I got it! But the the AI is on me, man. It's on me. There it is. This is 100% the best Zaha has ever felt in FIFA. Like, I'll tell you that much. No, dude, come on. Oh, this card is fun to use, man. Holy. Bro, oh, he actually did an animation against the defender for the uh, the rainbow flick, eh? Oh my goodness! See what I'm saying about the restriction? Like, I do a, I do a shot count, so I'm trying to do like a quick left stick, you know? Couldn't do it there. But that's honestly, guys, that's like the main thing you have to work with because his attacking AI is actually solid, right? It's just the left stick. That's it. Because obviously, it's even it's not even that big of a deal because he has the five star skills, you know? Oh, over the bar on that one. Dang it. What's the goalkeeper? Yeah, you're not supposed to shoot, but I wanted to try it anyways. Oh, it's a foul. Okay, good. Oh, sorry. I just wanted to go for the fancy. I was sick, though. Bro, L1 Elastical, man. I'm telling you. <laughs> what is that, dude? His shooting is great, bro. I'm telling you. I really like his shooting. Power strikes on the weak foot, strong foot. It's coming off great. Oh. Too close, yeah. Way too close. Uh, too close to the goalkeeper on my part, but I wanted to try regardless. No, go Zaha. Ah. Oh. oh, no timing on that either, eh? Hmm. He's really accurate with those things, eh? Like that's a really far distance away from the goalkeeper, and he still hits it okay. That's the one. That's the meta, boys. That's the meta. 
Yeah, it's literally just like the left stick. Like he has that little bit of a feeling with the restrictiveness, but that's it. Everything else is pretty good. Attacking AI is solid. Shooting comes off great. Solid card, man. Okay, guys. So final verdict on the new Zaha card. So guys, uh, it's actually funny because we ended up buying this card on the market in the beginning stages. Like it was like after the release, it was like 230 or whatever when I bought all four of these guys. They all went up in price. So W for the review account. W for the review account. Uh, guys, Zaha's extinct right now, which is <laughs> lucky me. You know, I get to sell him now for a pretty decent price. Uh, but guys, listen, man. In my opinion, uh, this is the best Zaha has felt in FIFA for all of the years. Genuinely, the only thing that is off about this card is... And this is a thing with this card over the years. Like, he's always he always has this thing about his card, okay? His unique body type puts some sort of, like physical no it's not a physical restriction because he's he's physical oriented right but it makes his dribbling like left stick wise less agile you know what i'm saying like you can tell that he has this like sway on it but genuinely that's the only thing that's like not that crazy about the card attacking ai is pretty dope his five star skill must come off great uh his shooting from those volleys even on a marksman chemistry style is pretty accurate when you're inside the 18 yard box. Uh, his shooting in general is very nice. Whether I hit it on his left foot or his right foot, he hits them great. Sometimes has a pretty saucy animation on the finesse shot. Base card stats for pace is really nice, but I will say that it doesn't feel as agile in the acceleration and sprint speed department when you're actually like using it, like actually running towards the ball. But when it's AI doing those like aggressive attacking AI moves, that's when you notice it being decent. So it's it's one of those types of situations, right? His body type definitely hinders the card a little bit, but it also kind of gives him a physical, which to be fair, I don't really care too much about. If he had like a different type of unique body type, Zaha would be an absolutely insane card, okay? Insane as in like everything is really good. But guys, honestly, if you can get past that left stick part, which isn't even that bad because you don't use it like crazy often, like you want to pass and go as much as possible, the card is actually really solid. I thoroughly enjoyed using him. This is definitely the best year that he's ever felt, 100%, okay? Definitely one of those types of situations. But uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video today. I'll catch you guys for the next one. Peace out, dudes. Love you guys.